I've had this godforsaken theory stuck in my head for the longest time. And I know, I know, I kind of like requited, acquitted, I don't know, said I'll stop making miraculous videos till the official English dub of the first episode comes out. But then this theory just would not leave my head. And then I saw a spoiler kind of thing that Luca gets akumatized again into the truth or something. And I'm like, oh, my theory gonna get confirmed no so i'm just making this video just in case you know just in case and i know some of you might argue and or claim tvc you're just remaking one of your most popular videos and yes you are correct but also no I want Luca to get some spotlight and it's about time I start giving my attention to the other male miraculous character that I really like outside of Adrian. So it's a win-win for all of us. Besides, I really need the views. But before we get into any of that, I gotta do the usual YouTuber thing because I've been stuck at 50k subs for a while now and I want to hit 60 sometime soon. But my analytics says that I... That that ain't happening till November, and that just makes me depressed. So please, please, if you're not subscribed already, please consider subscribing because I talk about a lot of cartoon stuff, a lot of fun cartoon stuff, insane cartoon stuff that pops into my head. So if you want to know whatever insanity TVC is up to, just hit the subscribe button. But on the other side of that spectrum, if you want virtual internet cloud, you can support me on Patreon and or become a YouTube channel member and get your name featured at the beginning and end of every single one of my videos. The amount you support me with dictates how shiny your name will look and all that fun stuff. Everything is listed on my Patreon or YouTube channel memberships. What else do I got to shell out or leech i got merch but i got a lot of positive merch sales this month so i'm not gonna force it down your throat anyway luca kofi kofefe um he cute boy can get it like marinette not me let me make that clear but luca is a very divisive character among the fandom some people love him some people hate him some people just don't want him to exist the amount of people who come into my comment section and tell me luca is 17 luca is an adult how dare he go after marinette marinette is a minor and i'm like bitch where did you get your information from luca is highest a year older than julica some people have even come and told me hey He's Julica's twin sister. I think I got that information in my last live stream. So, what's with all the hate? Even if he wasn't Julica's twin and she, he was her older brother, that still doesn't denounce the fact that people are aging up this character just so the ship doesn't sail. Like, come on guys, have better reasons not to ship Lucanet. But... I should even be grateful that they actually make up a reason to not like Luca. People just hate Kagami for no reason. So far, nobody has gave me a legitimate reason to hate this girl. Which is why she's like my second favorite character. I just like going against the grain. My favorite is Adrian, by the way. Marinette barely makes the top five. Okay, what was I talking about? Oh, Luca. <laughs> the only reason for this theory ever even existing is because of this one image. When I was making my... Who do you like better, Luca or Adrian? I just saw this look that Luca gave Marinette and I was like, you don't look at somebody like that unless you know them. Like he was giving her love bug eyes. Like he was looking at her like, a like how Adrian looks at Ladybug. But like how he romantically, how Cat Noir romantically looks at Ladybug or how Marinette looks at Adrian. You know the drift. That is not the look a civilian gives a superhero that they look up to. So then the gears in my brain started turning, which is never a good thing, mind you. And I thought, oh my god, what if Luca actually figures it out? Because here's the thing, Adrian is not dumb, but Adrian has figured out Marina's secret a lot. But time travel, reverse whatever had to be put into play to make the boy seem dumb or oblivious but with luca after i saw um 
Silencer and Desperada. He has more screen time than our main baby boy, but my anger towards the injustice of Adrian aggressed aside. I need to reel that bitch in because she was about to rear her ugly head. Luca gets a lot more attention and screen time to his dedicated episodes and he's shown to not be dumb. He's shown to know Marinette and he knows her intricacies, her details. He knows her more than Adrian ever will. Adrian might say she's just a friend and everything, which is kind of true because he doesn't really know her. Luca knows Marinette. He wrote a song about her and everything. So if there's actually a character right now in the Miraculous Universe that has the highest chance of figuring out Marinette's secret, it's Luca. And that shit terrifies me because I don't know what I would do if this show made Luca figure it out before Adrian. Ah, the rage I feel because I would not put it past dear daddy ostrix, dear, dear hawk daddy, Thomas, the bane of the fandom's existence. <sighs> I need to calm down. I can't get angry at a hypothetical. I just can't. I can't. But it... it it makes sense for Thomas. He goes about destroying fan ships, fan head cannons, and everything to prove to us that hey, he knows better. He he knows what he's doing. Anything that we, the peasants, can think up, it's second rate to his. And how insane would it be for him to kind of have this trick? Where Luca figures it out, but like Luca doesn't tell Marinette, and it's kind of like a thing in the background. And I want to rip out my own heart. It hurts. Ow! I'm in my chest so hard. Don't break a rib cage, TVC. But probably will if that happens. I'll probably break my TV. Will I drop this show? No. Will some people? Yes. A lot of people have already dropped this show. I know there's a lot of you watching my videos as a way to not watch the show. And I thank you. You're giving me views. You're giving me money. But don't use my suffering as a way for y'all bastards to get out of watching the show yourselves. That ain't fair. But that's where this theory would end. Let me know what you think. Do you think Luca would figure it out? Or if the show would actually go the route of anyone figuring it out because I feel, I wish, I hope, down deep down in my core, I hope that the show is going towards a reveal where both Marinette and Adrian figure out each other's identities at the same time. But I have a sneaking suspicion that Marinette will figure it out first. But out of sheer spite, I refuse to make that video. Because I don't even want to wish, think, make it into existence. Think it into existence. But if that's not the route the show is going, because love it or hate it, Miraculous does. Oh, what's the word? Something, expectations, subverse, reverse? Subvert expectations, that whole bullshit that's happening in American Western media. Miraculous kind of subverts our expectations. We expect something to happen, something as plain and broad as daylight, but it doesn't. So the show might subvert our expectation and make it like... Everybody knows the secret except the main two idiots. But hey, um, Alex actually knows. Future Alex knows who the two miraculous holders are. But could she be the only one? So there's a leg. There's a little bit of wiggle room. This theory has a bit of a leg to stand on because you guys know I speak off the top of my head. So literally, Alex just popped in as I was talking, and I'm like, yeah, she knows. So there's no hard rule that somebody can't know. But Alex kind of said, oh, she can keep a secret. I think Luca can keep a secret too. That's just me. He knows. He been knew that Marinette liked Adrian, but he never wanted to address it till like Marinette made it so painfully obvious so him figuring out the ladybug secret and not saying it hell maybe adrian actually figured it out too and luke and adrian can have a can, can kind of have like a little cute thing let me hope let me dream please <laughs> but yeah that's where this video is gonna end why did i make this <laughs> this video is pain i cause my own suffering for the entertainment of random people on the internet. What has my life become?
<laughs> but I'm happy. Better this than being in an office or being a doctor like my parents wanted me to be. <laughs> Get out of here. But yeah, thanks for asking so much for clicking and watch. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Do all the things. Let's see if this video gets um, 200 likes. Yeah, if this video gets 200 likes. No, 200 is easy. 500. If this video gets 500 likes, I will make a review video for the current episode of Miracles That Is Out. I actually did this on a community post and I said in it that if we hit 500 likes, I would make a review video for the episode of Miracles That Is Out. I don't want to say first episode because you guys gotta keep telling me it's the sixth episode, but it's the first official episode out. So it's episode one to me right now. But as of recording this video, that community post has 315 likes, which is a bit unfair because my community posts don't really get that much likes. But you guys tried, so I'm giving you a chance again. If this video hits 500 likes, I will do a live re uh, review, whatever, what I normally do to the current available episode of Miraculous, which is the first one to come out in season four, but is the sixth episode. I know. I goddamn know now. But yeah, 500 likes, and we'll do that. Let's have fun in the community. But yeah, that's where I'm gonna end the video. Thanks everybody so, so much for looking to watch. And or but with that being said, this is TVC. Mwah. Sign out.